Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue while launching or while playing the Valorant. The game is crashing with a blank error message with a yellow exclamatory sign. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. You need to right click on the taskbar and choose the option task manager over here. Now from the left pane, click on the option details tab. Now right in the search box, type in Rohit. Whatever own services are present right over here, you need to right click on each of the service and choose the option end task. You need to close each and every Rohit client processes. After doing so, type in Valorant. If it is running, do the same to close it. And thirdly is Vanguard. If this is also running, you need to right click on it and choose the option end task to completely close Vanguard, Rohit client as well as Valorant. After doing so, click on start menu, type CMD and you need to choose the option run as administrator. Now you need to type here two comments one by one. First one is SC delete VGC and then hit the enter key. Next one is SC delete space VGK and then hit the enter key again. Now once both the commands are deleted properly, make sure to restart your PC else this method will not work out. So restarting the PC is a mandatory step. After restarting, head over to this PC, C drive, program files and here you will find a folder with the name Roet Vanguard. You need to right click on this folder and choose the option delete. Once the folder is deleted, close it. Now you need to launch your Roet client into system again. Now you need to sign in right over here. I will go ahead and sign in onto my Roet client. Now once the sign in is completed, whatever your game is, whether it is Valorant or it is League of Legends, you need to click on the option update because update option is available after deleting the Vanguard. Click on the option update. Wait for it to finish updating and installing the Vanguard right into your system. Once it is completed, you need to minimize it. Then right click on start menu, choose the option run, type here services.msc and then hit the enter key. Now right over here, press the V key to find a service with the name VGC. Right click on it, go to its properties. If the service status is stopped, click on the start option to start the service at once. Once service is started, from the startup type, choose automatic. Then hit apply and OK button. Now close it. Now you are ready to launch the Valorant. Go ahead, launch the Valorant and this time the issue of the game is crashing with a blank error message will be completely fixed out. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue saving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.